Karibu tena tunaanza na ile taarifa ya Sharia Committee kuhusiana na kampeni za jubilee huko Fika ambapo uh, naibu wa rais William Ruto ameongoza uh, viongozi wengine waliochaguliwa katika mikutano katika kaunti ya Kiambu ambapo amesisitiza kwamba kamwe hata ruhusu shinikizo za muungano wa NASA kutaka kuondolewa kwa makamishna wa tume ya uchaguzi Sharia Committee ana maelezo kamili Uamuzi wa mahakama ya juu kubatilisha ushindi wa uhuru Kenyatta kwenye uchaguzi mkuu wa August 8 na mjadala wa uhalali wa ABC kusimamia uchaguzi mwingine vilitawala mikutano ya viongozi wa Jubilee walipoongoza na naibu wa rais William Ruto kupiga kampeni katika maeneo tofauti katika kaunti ya Kiambu. To say here that 15 million Kenyans went to vote and elected a president and that election and the number of votes he got is not in dispute. And four people have gone to overturn the mandate and the verdict of 15 million Kenyans. They have orchestrated and they have executed a civilian coup against the free will and the verdict of the people of Kenya and their place in history is a place of shame. Shutuma dhidi ya mahakama ya juu kwa mara nyingine zilishamiri huku wana jubilo wakiendeleza kauli ya raisu uru kenyata kuhusu mipango yao. Tare ambao tunarudia uchaguzi, tunaenda kuonyesha Supreme Court ya kuamba mwanainji, ndiyo hako na nguvu kuliko mahakama. Ingawa mungano wa NASA umeshikilia kwamba ni lazima tume ya IBC fanyo mageuzi kabla ya uchaguzi huo, chama ja jubilii kinasema hilo aliwezekani pike kura ambayo inakuja tuokoe demokrasia ya Kenya na tukae na uhuru wetu jamani tuliambiwa kabla tujapika kura kwamba huyu mzee hakuwa na haja na kura alitaka kuharibu IBC alitaka kuharibu all institutions ili kwamba apate serikali ya nisumkate Mbali na mikutano ya hadhara, viongoza hawa lijumu ika na omini wa kanisa la St. Andrews S.E.K. mjini Thika. Shadrak Miti, kitienle weekendi.